big. Oh, a big goofy looking motherfucker, too. So the point of the scripture was the angels give them understanding of how to deal with nuclear missiles and so on and so on. Back to Isaiah. Come on, what's up with all these Johnny come lately Israelites thinking they know something, bro? Like I said, we've been out here longer than any Israelite group out here. We've been out here longer than all y'all. Right, we're grinding, you know what I'm grinding, Now all of a sudden, they just popping out the cut. You right. know what I'm right. they know everything. Yeah, we've been on the grind, bro. Bro, we've been out here for years and years. Where the you fuck? Know, but you know, the TV. Literally, bro. Yeah, you know he ain't on the streets. Right. These motherfuckers, man, right. act like they know something, bro. Right, right. Been out here way longer than your raggedy ass. Right. Y'all ain't even out there. IUIC ain't even out here. They come out here and hand out flyers. <laughs> Busy bodies working not at all. <laughs> you know, you know it's, it's, it, the Israel get more popular now. Now all these motherfuckers think they know something. Oh yeah, fad, fad. Right, it's a right. fad now. Yep. Yep. We've been doing Dash. this before. It was a fad. Right. Y'all motherfuckers have come out to cut like some goddamn roaches. The light shine on you, and you scurry. You know what I mean? <laughs> you, you run your ass Shoo. back under the fridge. Shoo. Right. <laughs> Because can't none of y'all raggedy ass Israelites deal with us in the scriptures. All you bootlegged Israelites, you don't know no scriptures. IUIC got no scriptures. That asshole that just did a drop walk by scoff, get no scriptures. They can't deal with it, bro. You know what I mean? No wicked devil. Scriptures say to debate thy cause. That's right. Defend the gospel. Right, defend the gospel. Yeah, 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 yeah. With your bald headed ass. Contend for the truth. <laughs> <laughs> you know, stupid looking beard. It should look stupid. It looked like he died. And, and bleached. It yeah, like had, had red in it. Yeah. It looked bleached or something. Oh, you know, that's how no Ethiopian Hamites or Canaanites be built. They be making their beat the shit bomb. They, they, they let they they let um they let a pit cat in his cow piss. <laughs> it's, a, it's the ammonia that's in cat piss. I mean cow piss. It's the ammonia in urine. You know? You yeah, because yeah, your boy, we probably gonna sound like Edomite or something. Like I never but, even heard well, that for well, years and well, years. You know what? We gonna call him a Canaanite. Yeah, like, <laughs> right, for years and years, I ain't never had nobody come up saying no crazy shit like that. Yeah. All of a sudden, just all of a sudden, right. oh yeah, got that Edomite right. with right. you. Right. Well, you a big faggot? How about that? Hamite. No, please be not a hamite. Been out here teaching longer than all you faggots. They can tell too, that's why they scoff. Yeah. They mad, they mad. <laughs> they mad. Let's get back to the scripture. Fuck yes. me. Isaiah 54 and 16. Behold, I have created the smith that bloweth the coals in the fire, and that bringeth forth an instrument for his work, and I have created the waster to destroy. So the Lord created a waster to destroy. That's some scientists. You know what I mean? Hey, they get paid good money. The Lord take care of them too, Ooh, don't he? They, they, they make it sure they yeah, protect them. Yeah, they you know assassinate I mean? a lot of them too, though. Yeah, yeah, they do. They let them do their job and then kill them after they're done. Oh, yeah. You know you know how America is. <laughs> hey, that is the eat them right way, though. Right. Right. That's like the, the, the uh, Mongo, uh, uh, fuck, I'm saying it wrong. The Mongol, or, uh, what, uh, goddamn, uh, what's that bitch's name? Genghis Khan and the Mongols. Remember when he died? Because you know they was the Edomites, right? But they were buried when they they never found Genghis Khan's grave because the custom to bury the uh, the Mongol kings was the uh, after the people buried him, the people that buried him were killed, so nobody could find his grave. Wow! So that's that's long been an Esau spirit to uh, do shit like that. Who the fuck would want to work for Esau? Okay. Oh, yeah. Two thirds. Out your goddamn mind. It's like all these people, man. They they like you. They want to be in the government, or you know what I mean. That you end up getting assassinated. You find out some shit you shouldn't have found out. Yeah, yeah. Fuck that. I'd rather work at goddamn McDonald's. Fuck that. Fuck that. Here you go. Here you go. I'll talk to you about that later. Love you. Isaiah 30. Woe to the rebellious children, said the Lord, that take counsel, but not of me, and that cover with a covering, but not of my spirit. Right. All these fools out there, they don't got the spirit of the Lord with it. They got a, the spirit of uh, uh, demons and devils of the house above. You know what I'm saying? Well, we see examples of that. 
Go ahead. That they may add sin to sin. Yep, go ahead. walk to go down into Egypt and have thine ass at my mouth to strengthen themselves in the strength of Pharaoh and to trust in the shadow of Egypt. Well, yeah, you go on to that. Now, you got a lot of people actually claiming they Egyptians. They going to talk about they descend from a Pharaoh. That's not nothing to be proud of, bro. Motherfucking pharaohs all marry their sisters. They worship cats and dogs. You gonna tell them you worship cat? You know, be like, they didn't really worship animals. Yes, they did. They built temples for bulls. And then after the bull died, they were mummified like it was a pharaoh. Cats too. Yeah, they mummified cats. What kind of crazy person mummifies cats and bulls? And get that's, that's bugged out, bro. And that cat is a cat, a, a hairless cat. Yeah, hair, that's crazy. Just the spirit, yeah, that's what Separation of didn't even have a chin, it was just all neck. Right, right. My right. son told me a joke the other day. He said, Your mom's so fat, she walked in front of the TV, you missed the whole show. <laughs> yeah. What's up, bro? Here's your lights. Here's your lights. That's good. This is yours, man. This is your heritage, man. This is yours. This is all just That's for you coming. and your son. The Lord is waking up to hear the lights of the children of Israel. Before we were lost sheep. Before we found out we were Israelites, we were lost sheep. Right. And so let me get Israelites. that. So we're waking up the lost sheep. Let them know who they are, Israelites. We ain't niggas. We ain't black men. African American, Negro, you know, all whatever other name they can come up with, Egyptians. You know, we ain't none of that. We're Israelites. We're the children of God. You know, we're the prince of power. We are the 12 tribes of Israel, the prince of power. Let me read the scripture. You know? Uh, I'm going to get this, John 10, 7. And then, and you know, the Lord's real name is not Jesus. Like, this right here is not Jesus. The Lord's real name is Yahweh Shai. That's in the Hebrew tongue. That's the ancient language of Israel. The Lord spoke Hebrew. He didn't speak Greek, Latin, any of that. He could have through spirit. Yeah. The Lord spoke Hebrew. Yeah, his native tongue was Hebrew. The Bible was written in Hebrew. Right, so we received his name through the spirit. Yep, Yahweh Shai. Let me get that. John 10 and 7. Then said Yahweh Shai unto them again, Verily, verily, I say unto you, I am the door of the sheep. Like he was saying, we the lost sheep of Israel. Yahweh Shai is that door that you got to walk through. To there is no other way. There is no other right. Way. All that ever came before me are thieves and robbers. But the sheep did not hear this. I had a dream. I had a dream. And it said the sheep didn't hear that. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know what I'm saying? Because the sheep hears the Lord's voice. Yeah. So, oh, and so if people don't agree with us, they're they not part of that sheep. You know what I mean? Uh, uh, John 10. He said, uh, uh, I am the door. By me, if any man enter in, he shall be saved and shall go in and out and find pasture. Oh, and pa you know the word pasture. Come, you ever hear the word pasture, right? Yeah, that comes from the word pasture. Because, you know, uh, the good shepherd is supposed to lead his sheep to a green pasture. So, so they can eat good. And we're shepherds. Right? Yeah, we're shepherds. Yeah, yeah, that's what it means. When you look the word up, it goes, pastor means pasture. The thing is, we out here to wake up the other shepherds. And that other shepherds are the 144,000 yep. men. Not women, but men. You know? They're sheep herders. Uh, the thief come a not, but for to steal and to kill and destroy. I am come that they might have life. And that it, they might have a more abundant that life. Is that true. Yeah, this truth is life. Abundance is a living water. Yeah, yeah you got four like water. Huh? Like we always, this is like an oasis right here in the middle of a desert. You see what I'm saying? The fountain of life. This is a needle in the hemisphere. Yep. And the Lord guides you to it. Every few to find it. Few to find it. You know what I'm saying? It's like that lost treasure map they found up in the attic. Right. Hey, you know what I'm saying? Right. Uh, the X marks the spot. Look, I am the good shepherd. The good shepherd giveth his life for the sheep. 
debate. And we are we have presented our bodies as living sacrifices yep. to come out here and we can plan these people plan our lives been threatened, just pushing the truth and everything. They done threaten us all kind of ways, haven't they? They done tried to rise up against them, but they know what happened to us. Who is Everybody this other person me. in this picture? That's a that's the same person. This is a, a man by the name of uh, Chandra Borgia. He was oh. a, he was the son of a uh, back in 14. His father became Pope in 1492, which is a famous year. 1492, I heard of that. Yeah, I his father that. became Pope that year, so his, the Pope was behind all that. And his father was a uh, Pope, uh, well, Alexander the Sixth, right? But his name was a uh, Chandra Borgia. Harry, so. Yeah, they, a lot of people say Caesar Borgia. Yeah, how do you say Chandra? Yeah. But that's who the image that that popular image was based on. You know what I'm saying? When you go into the history of it, you'll find out that that popular image of so-called Jesus was based, based on, on this guy. guy. Yeah. Let me read this for you. This is Wisdom of Solomon 15. I'm gonna start at three. For to know thee is perfect righteousness. Yea, to know thy power is the root of immortality. For neither did the mischievous inventions of men deceive us, nor an image spotted with diverse colors colors a painter's fruitless labors. Because this this ain't gonna deliver nobody, this false image. Right. You know, right. The true Lord, the true power is gonna give us a power. So the true the story of Jesus is not right. This, right. That's, exactly. that's, that's not true. That's right. That's right. Oh, that's, a that's a devil. That's a devil. The scripture and actually you. that's a biblical eat of false image. When you watch a movie there's a good guy and a bad guy. It's your boy. When you read the Bible there's a good guy and a bad guy. The good guys are the Israel the elect of Israel. The bad guys is the evil Edomites, the so-called white man. The so-called white man. I got, Edomites. I got a precept for you to go into that. Uh, they go that Job 9 and 24. Uh-oh, we got to hurry up. Job 9 and 24. The earth is given into the hand of the wicked. He covereth the faces of the judges thereof. What the bankers look like? They ain't none of us. No, the bankers, we're all childs. Okay. The main family is the royal chapters, and then it trickled down to like the, you know, uh, the queen of, of England, the queen and prince of England. Uh, yeah. the, uh, what's the what's the what's the Jay Z and them under? Wales. Uh, rock the, uh, I can't remember the other ones. I can't think right now. But what? anyway, this is the devil. The Edomite. 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 So called biblical Edomite. <laughs> if you want to come back out again, man, you got to hear every Monday at the same time. Oh, okay. Yeah. 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 Revelation 12. We'll say it again, man. Can I read Revelation 12? Yeah. Why you want to read that for? I'm going to explain it to you. Okay. I've got to get entertained. <laughs> Better do it right, bro. Okay, my best is best. <laughs> he got, that's that goal. He got that goal of spirit. 12 and 1, though. 12 and 1. 12 and 1. 12 and 1. This is Revelation 12 and 1. And there appeared a great wonder in heaven. A woman clothed with the sun. Who's that woman? The church. No. The church. Yeah, it is the, no, it is the church, but the real church is Israel. No, it can't be. Read it. It says it's 12 stars. The moon under her feet. Who's the first people to touch the moon with their feet? It ain't got nothing to do with that. It's going into something else. Yeah, who's the first people The moon and sun under her feet. You're talking about wisdom, knowledge, and understanding. Like and rulership. Like the Americans touch the moon. They're like they don't know the moon. Hey, read that. We're going to tell you. Look, it tells you she had a crown of 12 stars. That's the apostles. If it wasn't for the apostles, we wouldn't have this book. Exactly. Who's the apostle? What nation was that? They were all Israelites. Israelites. That, 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 that woman is Israel because woman, uh, Israel it's is... It's the church. It's the bride. The, who's the bride? Is Israel. The bride. That's the Israelites. Talk, it talks about the Israelites and 144,000. That's Moses the bride. Had a new song. And that's the bride. This is a new song. We married to the Most High. That's, that's Israel. Israel's a. You don't believe nobody touched the moon with their feet? No, no. Nah. No. They ain't no. been to the moon. The yeah. white man ain't been to the moon either. He's lost. Nah. He lost. Yeah, all you seen was a movie. That's a parable. All anyway. the clips you seen on videos, that's just a movie. Yeah, that's all it was. You get your satellites. Oh, it. check it out. Check it out. You seen the X Men? Yes. Yeah, okay, the X Men are real? Cyclops, he got a red glasses on. He can shoot lasers out his eyes. Stop running. Come on, bro. The Revelation 12, they're put a wonder in heaven. Can you read this real quick? Yeah, right. This, this, this is the woman. This is Jeremiah 6 and 2. Oh, good scripture. But you go into the listen, daughter. I have likened, I have likened the daughter of Zion to a comely and delicate woman. The daughter, like Israel as a whole, were known as a uh, comely, delicate woman. 
Because usually in the Bible, nations are, whole nations are referred to as uh, women. You know what I'm saying? Like, America is referred to as a woman. Not all nations. Like all Bible nations are, like, yeah. It's, it's like a thing. It's like they call boats women. And then they call cars women. B.B. Uh, B. King named his guitar a woman. I call my Bible my book. It, 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 it's our Bible. It was a, the Bible is likened unto a woman. King Tyrus. Tyrus. Yeah. I mean, Cyrus. I mean, Alexander. Yeah. Their towns wasn't named after women. They were named after men. <laughs> we know this, man. <laughs> It's just parabolic talk, bro. It's a metaphor. You said all nations in the Bible were in the woman. I said many times. Many times. Bro. Many times. Like America, Babylon was called the virgin daughter of Babylon. Esau is called the virgin daughter of Babylon. Edom. Who's Edom? Alexander is Edom. He's an Esau. No, Edom was Esau. Is Esau. Esau. Who's Ale Ale Alexander the Great was a Macedonian. Uh, an Edomite. We can prove it in the, by the scriptures that the Macedonians were Edomites. That's good. You can read I read that. I don't know what. The thing is, what you read, you got to get understanding with what you read. You just can't interpret it on your own, man. You need people to teach you what you read, man. So you got to listen. Sometimes listen, man, you know. Then go read. But let him, let him, let the brother teach you something, man. You know what I mean? Can the scriptures tell you that, that uh, you can extrapolate from the scriptures that it tell you the Macedonians were you Edomites. Love your dog, don't you? Edomites were living up do. there. I know you do. Philip was an Edomite. Alexander was an Edomite. Who said he would not live in Alexander's father? Yeah, there's an Edomite. We know that. You know who Haman is? Haman was an Esther. Right, they, uh, he was an Edomite. Right, he was a, exactly. And the scriptures tell you that he was also a Macedonian. And in the Apocrypha, it tells you he was from Macedon. I don't read the Apocrypha. Well, it's in the Bible. At, where's Alexander spoken of in the Bible? Besides Daniel, the, the goat, that's right? On the but he's he's in the apocrypha though. They give you the history on Alexander and all of his uh the, his uh, apocrypha, kings. That's the Roman church. No, bring bust out the apocrypha. What does it say on it? It says King James, baby. See that apocrypha authorized King James. King first. James. The apocrypha, which means hidden or secret. He sounded like he found Sauron's ring in the river. Yes. Time. I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I I his name is Sh his name is Schmeagles. It's Schmeagles. You play one, boy. But this series like death for you, and you, and you, and you, and you. What the hell are you drinking, bro? Coffee. Oh, you don't need no more of that coffee. Yeah, you got some of that lean in there. You sitting on that coat in there. You got some purple drink. That's all serious. I see the music side. Do the so-called American. You don't know about Israel? You obviously don't know about Israel. You butchered Revelation 12. You butchered it. What about 10 and 11? What about it? What about 10? You can read it all. You know Revelation 10? I know. We don't know all the Revelations. You read 10. Read it. Where's your Bible? I he got some glasses with no lenses. He got it going. He died when he came out. He died when he came out. Oh my God. He tripped. Revelation 10. Revelation 10. All right. Revelation. I haven't actually. I'm just going to read Ecclesiastes. <laughs> I'm gonna get Ecclesiastes 10. I'll give you a 10. You're gonna get a 10. Get that 10, baby. I got that 10, Jim man. 10. Who wrote that? The preacher man? It's the preacher man. It's a king. Solomon. The man, the wisest man to ever live. Yes, he. Okay. Then Jesus. Okay. Solomon. Sure. I was my homie right there. He got 900 days and started getting his dicks up 900 times. And let me get this. Bruh. Ecclesiastes, listen, this is that 10. Start working with another God. Watch him, watch him. You got up in age. You got a little tired. You got up in age. 
Well, I mean, yeah, the, the, the woman would do strange oh, things to you. What you seen? Oh, it's a for when it came back. That's the Lewis. Let me let me read this for you, bro. Ecclesiastes 10 and 12. The words of a wise man mouth are gracious. The lips of a fool will swallow up himself. The beginning of the words of his mouth is foolishness, and the end of his talk is mischievous madness. So you come up here with that mischievous madness, bro. I came up talking about the Bible the you, whole time. Yeah, talking like Schmeagle. Talking so, dude, I just, I said down. the Bible. Let me read this Back in Ecclesiastes 5 and 1, keep that foot when that goes to the house of God, and be more ready to hear it than to give the sacrifice of fools. You come over here talking crazy, bro. You sound like you got demons on you. Yeah. Sipping on that crazy drink, that loco juice. Coffee. Well, you don't need no more coffee. That sacrifice you presented to brother, yourself it was your so called wisdom, knowledge, and understanding that came to know. Yeah, but like it says, get, like it says, when you come to the church, keep your foot. When you come to the church, hold your mouth, man. You just listen and learn, yes. so you can learn something. How can you learn if you keep opening your mouth? You can't learn if you learn your mouth, right? Right? For they consider not that they do evil. So you know, now you, you don't think consider you do evil, even though know, you act crazy as hell. <laughs> Coming up in that old dirty bastard spirit. Old oh, dirty bastard. <laughs> Be you not, know, man. Be not rash with thy mouth, and let not thine heart be hasty to utter anything before the Most High. For Most High is in heaven, and thou upon earth. Therefore let thy words be few. The few words you be speaking should be a question. You know, a legitimate question of what we're talking about. That's only a few words you should speak, speak as those questions. Don't give us what you know. Because the world's wisdom and knowledge is nothing compared to the world. It has nothing to do with it, with the scriptures. Okay? They, they're not compatible. The world's wisdom and the truth—they're not compatible. They said God's wisdom is foolishness because of preaching. Like, that's us. That's referring to us. No, it says God's foolishness is wiser than the wisdom of men. Yes, that's what it says. Preaching, and that's us. That's this is the foolishness of the world right here. This is foolishness. Yeah, it, the scripture said we made fools for Yahweh Shai's sake. Yahweh Shai. Be careful saying it like that. You don't make mockery of the name. You didn't make. You small thinking you're chicken going down the street. You be trying to catch it. Nick. What? You know what I'm saying? I'm going to wake up waking tomorrow. Come on, like then Daniel. Dude, he literally turned dude into a beast. He was out there in the field raising with the animals, right? You know, you wake up, like I said, man, waking up. Yeah, you going to wake up eating grass, bro. You know, moving like a cow. I was over there eating grass. I believe it. Hey, hit you with the dark to put him. We gotta put him down. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Hey, what's up, sweetie? Oh, what's up, girl? Good, how are you? Good, 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 good. What you been up to? Same Anything? thing. Same thing? Yeah, yeah. Bringing out those scriptures. Same thing. I see. Hello. Surviving I'm through, this, through this chair. Are you a Christian? Yes. What's your name? Huh? You know, Jesus coming back. Yeah. 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 How do you know? How do I know the Bible tells you so? Yes, Faith. And I have faith. You can't love this trust. You can't meet these people unless you're out here. You know, when you go on the internet, when you want to talk to people on the internet, you don't really meet that person. You know what I'm saying? You don't really know that person. But you come out here and you meet these people face to face. You learn people, man. You learn that these people are really evil. You know, that's what you learn. Learn how to read spirits. You know, you actually learn. And like I said, on the internet, Unless they reveal themselves as scoffers or whatever, you know, you know them. Like we always say, you can't. All right, then. You can't learn nothing until you start teaching that. It's the That's only way you learn. Right. Now you're making sense. I am making sense. Oh, let me read that. Correct. <laughs> Why, are you Why were you teaching that? You be out here teaching? No. I, Thank I, God I, you ain't out here teaching. I'm out here running wild in the hospital. Huh? You just escaped from uh, the Virtual hospital? Yeah. <laughs> he, was no. a, he was hanging out with Sling Blade. He was a, oh yeah. See? I just, I just had a, I just, I just had a chain. Uh, Ethiopia, Ethiopia. At the men, get to meet you, Ali. Ice, we got it. I don't know what you would say. Corinthians on deck. Uh -oh. uh, bring it up. 
First Corinthians, uh, talking about Sal. How much is this start at? Uh, Paul was a genius. 18. He was a genius. For yes. the preaching of the cross is to them. He look like him. Oh, yeah. Like like him. Him. For the preaching oh, of the cross is to them that perish foolishness. But unto us which are saved, it is the power of the hour. For it is written, I will destroy the wisdom of the wise and bring to nothing the understanding of the truth. That's what we're doing. We are here. We got these fools coming up, running their mouth. We shut it down. So through the Spirit of the Lord, we shut it down. Where is the scroll? Where, like you where came over here butchering Revelation 12. You had to not butchering. The, the Lord talked to you. Yes, every day. Yeah. You sure that's the Lord talking to you? His name. Yeah. It's not Lucifer. What's his name? Who's Lucifer though? Elohim. 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 Oh man. Yeah, there you go. Elohim. Where is the wise? Where is the scroll? Where is the dispute of this world? You know, it's actually pronounced. Uh, how, do you, uh, how do you spell that? A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L A L let me finish my business. Listen, listen. For after that, in the wisdom of the Most High, the world by wisdom knew not the Most High. It pleased the Most High by the foolishness of preaching to save them that believe. For the Jews required a sign, and the Greeks seek after wisdom. But we preach you how a shy crucified. Unto the Jews a stumbling block, and unto the Greeks foolish sign. Let me ask you a question. Who's the Greeks Paul is talking to? The Greeks, the, the philosophers, the wise men, the athletes. Right? The Dindians. Right? But who's the true philosopher? Paul was a true philosopher. He was a true philosopher. Yeah. You're right. Paul but so he, but Paul was talking to them. He went out his way to convert those Greeks, so-called Greeks. So, and the barbarians. And the barbarians. And those that the circumcised and the uncircumcised. Exactly. So who were Jew they? Jew and the Gentile. So there's no difference between the Jew and the Gentile. No. But the Jews so come they, first. So, but what is no? They don't. It's all yes, the same. It's all the same. There's no difference uh, between the Jew and the did Greek. The Jew come first. No. Abraham, they all Jews. Abraham at the gate, like it, collecting Jews. It said like there is no difference Jew, between Jew, the Jew, Jew and the Greek. What does that mean? There's no difference between Jew and the Greek. <laughs> who, who do the Greek?